Oh, hi there. I'm Bruce Buchanan, and this is... Kathy Marquardt. Um, I painted this uh, scenic slide for the uh, Western Cuyahoga Audubon Society, and um, Kathy is one of the people who picked one up. And I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I was attracted to the scenic slide because I'm an admirer of Bruce's work. I have been for a while, long time. And this has special meaning to me because I work in Rocky River and I've hiked and walked along the pathway that runs along the river and the um, scene that's on the slide, which Bruce has beautifully done. It's funny seeing this, having not seen it for a little while and coming back to it. it it's, um, you, know, you kind of remember, um, I said something about when I was painting it that you kind of get a chance to rediscover those little spots and those nooks and crannies and you discover the thing. So even looking at it now too, I'm kind of like, oh yeah, 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 I remember that little, that little super rocky edge and uh, that crest of that hill. And, you know, when I did it, it was still, there were still no uh, leaves on the trees. It's, uh, I don't know, it's ever changing. It's really nice to see. Um, I do like seeing the, the shininess of it. I think actually with the water reflection, there's something that happens with it being on glass that, um, I don't know, it, it translates nicely, I think. So, there you are. Yeah, I like the, the sepia tones and the feeling of um, timelessness about the slide and the scene. So where do you have it? I'm looking for the perfect place right now. <laughs> Because I want a place where the sun will shine through it, um, so I'm still searching for that perfect place. Gotcha. But right now I have it on the little shelf that goes between my sitting room and my kitchen because I'm in those both both of those rooms a lot, so I get to look at it a lot. I sort of imagined these as a um, as a as a windowsill piece, and and actually this is one of the first kind of slide type of things I've I've done and. In hindsight, now I'm kind of like, oh, this is really, um, this is something I want to play with a lot, you know, because you can you get an awful lot of impact out of, uh, I don't know, painting on glass. It's, um, I don't know, it's kind of mysterious a little bit, you know, um, and really just the fact that it plays on light all the time. Um, yeah, I'm certainly going to be <laughs> playing with this idea more. <laughs> 